What's going on YouTube? Fulton here at Mad Vapes and Boone and today we're going to do a little unboxing video of the iJoy Zenith 3. Now, this mod right here is very special because I already took it out of the box. As you can see, there's no screen on it whatsoever. In this lovely box, as you can see, there's a little sticker in there. It says 2700s are included with this bundle. So, you don't even have to buy batteries with this guy. You gotta buy this kit and you already get batteries. So we'll go ahead and take off the sleeve and unbox it real quick. Right in here, that's where the mod and the tank lie. Mod and tank right here. We'll go over that in just a second. But you also do have a replacement glass that matches the color of the Zenith. Very important things right there. A nice piece of foam to keep everything in place. And a lovely box filled with goodies. Now in here, you will find uh, extra grommets and uh, a vape band to help you out so you don't break your glass. It's always fun. An extra coil for the tank that comes on top. A user manual on how to use the device. That's what this video is for. So I tell you. Two, well, it's not two, but the sleeve for two 18650 batteries. So you can use 18650s with this device. Go ahead and put that over there. And a charging cable and lastly two 2700 batteries that come with the device now these are iJoy's uh, 2700 batteries they are 3000 ma so in total you'll have 6000 milliamp hours to play with with this device so that's enough about what comes in the box let's actually look at the mod itself so I'm gonna go ahead and put some batteries in this device. Throw my tank on so we can see what it does. When you do put the batteries inside of the device, they fit in just like so. Nice and snug. So you got a little ribbon right here. So you can pull the batteries out a little bit later whenever you need to charge them. Go ahead and close that bad boy up. It is already on, okay? And you see here, you actually have a little dial. Uh, it actually has different variable voltage settings that you can set it to from 2.4 all the way to 6.8 so if you're used to wattage then that means it goes all the way up to 300 watts i like to hit mine around 3.4 so this is 3.4 Woo! it's a lot of vapor let's pump it up to 3.8 why not or four Oh, it's a little burnt. So, as you can see, you can fine tune your hits with this little dial. It makes a little beep noise. So you know when you change it. Overall, I think this is a solid device. It's kind of mechanical and it's kind of not. There is a chip inside. There is a chip inside, so it is regulated, but you get that unregulated feel because you can bump it up so high. That's due to the power of the 2700s that do come with the device. So I highly recommend you use those batteries and buy some extra ones while you're here. And yeah, overall, I think it's a solid device. So it has a nice sleek look. Very, very clean looking. I really enjoy this mod. I might pick this one up. You never know. But we were, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, <laughs> right? But we will have more colors in the future, not just red. So if you're interested, definitely come on down to Mad Vapes of Boone. We're located at 240 Shadowland Drive in Boone, North Carolina in the Harris Teeter parking lot. You'll see us there. Also, if you're an App State student, you get 10% off this guy. Woohoo! And as always, guys, we will see you in the next video.